everyone so I'm back at you again with another video and today I wanted to review some dupes on the Valentino Rockstead flats and heels the brand that has these dupes of the Valentino shoes are Caitlin pan and this is the box that came in um, and again I got two different pairs so I'll show you both but they both came in the same exact box um, and then when I got them they smelled a little weird um, kind of like um, like a hairspray or um, kind of weird chemically, um, but I think they aired out and they're fine now. Um, so I'll show you the flats first, and these are them. Um, so as you can see, they really do look like Valentinos, and I really don't um, ever get like fakes or anything like that. Um, but I think this is different just because it's more of a dupe. It's not saying Valentino on it or anything like that. It does say Caitlyn um, Pan on the shoe itself. Um, but they do look very, very similar. So if you like the style and the look of Valentinos but don't want to spend, you know, $1,000, these were 100 And so I think this is a really good deal. Um, the studs are all really nicely lined all around the shoe. It also came with extra studs in case you um in case one comes off um so these are great it also um has the ankle strap right here and just a slight heel so that's what it looks like on the back um and these are made in china um so one thing about the sizing so for these um i got a size seven usually i'm a six and a half but on the website um, everyone had said a uh, size up or at least a half size up because they run, um, they run big or sorry, they run small. Um, so I did, I got a half size up. I went, um, a seven instead of my usual six and a half and they're slightly big. So I think if I went, um, back, I would get my regular size. So just get your regular size. That worked for me. Um, but the seven still is fine. It's just a little bit loose, but I think it'll be okay. So for the color, I got the Pood Ray. It's kind of a um, a nude color, um, but kind of like a purpley nude. It's really pretty. And it's also in the patent finish. I was debating between the matte and the patent, but I'm really happy I went with the patent. I think it looks really polished and sleek. Um, so now let's move on to the heels that I got. And so these are the heels. And these are gorgeous. And these ones I actually did do my regular size. I did a six and a half. And these fit perfect. And kind of a nude with the patent. Um, really, really pretty rock studs all around. And the heel um, is kind of a, a stiletto heel here. Um, and then it does say Caitlyn Pan here. And then also on the bottom. So overall, I'm really happy with both the shoes. Um, they do come in a variety of different colors and styles. Again, I got fairly similar styles in the flats and the heels. Um, they are slightly different. The heels are a little bit lighter, but um, they do come in other colors. And then for the flats, if you just want the studs around and no ankle strap, she does have a pair like that. Um, both of them are about $100. So compared to real Valentinos, which are over $1,000, it's a really good price. Um, I haven't actually worn them out. I wanted to do this video and kind of get it up there. So I might do a, um, updated wear and tear on how they are looking and how they kind of feel, um, actually on and wearing them. I will be going to New York soon. So I'll probably bring these along, um, as my heels. Um, but overall I'm really happy with how they look. And so we'll see how they wear. Um, I've heard from like the reviews, there's tons of reviews. If you look on the Amazon, um, shop that um, they wear really well and they actually, some people have real Valentinos and then these and they say that they're pretty much identical and look exactly the same. I would say the only thing that would probably be the most different is that um, smell that I was saying when you first get it, it has this chemically scent, but um, I've let, uh, I got these ones a, about a month ago and I've let them sit in the garage and they don't smell at all anymore. Um, these ones I just received, so I'll probably put these ones out to air um, but they shouldn't smell after that. Um, so overall, I'm really pleased with this purchase and I just wanted to kind of share that with you in case you were interested in getting them. I hope you enjoy this video and please hit that subscribe button down below. Thanks guys. Bye.